So in total, we provide primary health care services to an estimated 130,000 people, 44,000 being the nationals who are around the settlement and the rest being refugees. I don't even know what to think. We're going to see clinicians, we're going to see how they process people with health issues through the system. Um, I look forward to really seeing that for the first time instead of seeing pieces of paper and wondering how it really works. It's amazing work they're doing out here and it's just mind-boggling the amount of paperwork and registries and things they fill out. What uh, an individual has to go through, queuing up to get initially registered, queuing up to see the clinician, to see the lab, and get their lab results, to see the pharma, you know, go back to the clinician and then to the pharmacy. That whole process and that whole time, it's all paperwork, uh, you know, registries, books that they're filling out just begging, begging for technology to help solve, them that, solve that problem for them. We're going to have to really dig in, you know, we're going to have to figure out, I, you know, I think we got our eye on what we want to try and solve. We're learning new information today, uh, yesterday, and now it's about how to, how to take that and, and apply it quickly and come up with some, some good ideas and really start prototyping something that we can bring back and have people look at.